What's going on guys? Welcome to Everything Always. My name's Michael Roman, aka Allfires. Now admittedly, in the last two weeks, I've remarked that the hype for Deadpool and Wolverine doesn't feel quite as high as it was for, say, Avengers Endgame or Spider-Man No Way Home when we were six months out from the film. But that doesn't mean that there still isn't time to get there, and with the first trailer dropping and right around the corner next weekend at the Super Bowl, it may just be getting started. And as evidence of that, tonight what happened with Kevin Feige and footage of him at the Saturn Awards wearing a Deadpool and Wolverine logo hat sort of made it feel like the old days and all over again as Twitter threads were exploding trying to figure out what the back of the hat said as a lot of people thought it might be the official logo. We're going to go through it in full. People had a lot of great guesses. We're going to talk about what it most likely is, but then also try to figure it out just based on the image itself. And no, in 2024, and unfortunately at a major award show, no one was able to get a shot of it and not blurred. It's almost as if they did it on purpose, which I guarantee you they didn't. Still, we're going to break it down. Kevin Feige's official Deadpool and Wolverine logo reveal and what the back of the hat most likely said as far as what's going on with the title. But first, if you could grab the subscribe button, we do daily Marvel content at the channel and that's all we do. Everything from official Easter egg breakdowns, trailers and reviews to the occasional industry insider report and everything in between. So if that sort of thing's for you, hit the subscribe button, leave a comment down below that will automatically enter you to win our ongoing PS5 giveaway. The next one is right around the corner to coincide with X-Men 97, possibly next month. Again, all you got to do be a sub, leave a comment if you want, stick around to the end of the video we get into all the giveaway stuff again there okay so let's start with what we could see in hd and that's the front of the hat which revealed a brand new logo for deadpool and wolverine and ironically this is almost exactly like a fan-made logo and from almost two years ago when at first the film was being announced Obviously, it's half Deadpool and half Wolverine in the logo, and an artist did a great mock-up of what looks like exactly an HD version of what was on the front of his hat. But now let's get to the back of the hat where we got it again in a couple of quick looks, but because of the way it was and how fast he turned around, the camera could not capture focus. Okay, so here's the back of the hat. You can clearly see it says Marvel Studios, and then Deadpool is slightly off-centered, so most likely Deadpool 3, although some people thought it said Deadpool and Wolverine in a thinner font on the other side when he turns from his left to his right, but I just think there's not enough room there. Deadpool and 3 would line up a lot better. Now underneath that is what people suspect might be the subtitle, where from there, and even with the best enhancing and dropping of contrast, it is very hard to make out what the exact words are. Now, some of the initial guesses that started popping up on Twitter was that the first word looked like it was four letters, maybe eats or ears. And the second word sort of looked like it had ASS or two S's in it to start, which could be something like assembled. So basically a play on Avengers assembled, Deadpool 3 ears assembled, as in he's joining Disney. Some other people thought it might be Deadpool 3 in ears acquired. But that second word doesn't look like it quite has enough to it to have an A and a Q. There's just not enough room. Now, obviously, the first word is four letters. Then it's some other word. And then what looks like a very short word. And we could sit here and play this game all day. But because these type of hats are generally given out and for every Marvel production, unfortunately, most likely what these words are, are cast and crew 24 or when they filmed cast and crew 23 for 2023. Although admittedly, when said like that, it sort of does look like a cast and then an and sign crew and then 24 a four there on the end now obviously this is not the title of the film this is cast and crew hat and with other cast and crew items i've had in the past like a jacket and a hat one that was given to me from avengers endgame another that was given to me from miss marvel they definitely had cast and crew on there somewhere so it would make sense that would be the place to put it but it doesn't mean all is lost here in for a reveal the fact that the logo has wolverine just as much a part of it as deadpool sort of clues you in that some of the rumors we've heard about it being deadpool and Wolverine etc with the subtitle may actually be true and to go one step further than that and as many people forgot to point out when they were covering Matthew Vaughn's latest quotes about Deadpool saving the MCU is that a couple of sentences at the start of that quote which were getting cut off actually said for the snippets or clips that he's seen of Deadpool versus Wolverine and I think that there's a really good shot that Deadpool versus Wolverine with the subtitle is most likely the case outside of any of the other iterations we've heard like Deadpool and Wolverine or Deadpool 3 Wolverine etc Deadpool versus Wolverine then with a subtitle probably makes the most sense but guys we will not be waiting that much longer for an official title reveal and or the trailer which again is rumored to drop 
next weekend at the Super Bowl on Sunday, we will be doing a live watch party here at the channel. So if you're planning on hanging out for it, it's a great place to come by and hang as we wait. Guys, let me know all your thoughts though down below. If you think you see a different title in this, or if by the time I post this, maybe perhaps someone is gonna be able to enhance this HD get an HD clip and we'll of course add an edited comment if we get a different title or we can confirm the hats to something else but you guys let me know all your thoughts down below quickly let's get into the giveaway stuff before I let you go all right we are still giving away PlayStation 5s here at the channel we're going to continue to do so for every major Marvel drop so the next one is anticipated to be X-Men 97 and dropping next month in March if you want to be entered to win or for some of the tickets for Madam Web that we're giving away all the same rules will always apply Hit the subscribe button because you need to be a subscriber, then leave a comment down below. Because it's truly random, the more videos you comment on, the better chance you have of winning. All winners will be announced at the end of videos, the same way we're doing here. The best way to keep up with the content has always been to hit the notification bell with all notifications turned on. And as always, if you liked today's video, I'd appreciate it if you'd hit the like button. My name's Michael Roman. You can find me in a couple of places, Instagram and Twitter at I'm Fires. You can also find me on Spotify, YouTube, Amazon, Apple, iTunes, wherever you listen to original music under the name All Fires. And while I'd sincerely appreciate you checking my music out, thanks for checking this channel out. Stick around. We'll be posting again real, real soon.